Hello, my name is Adriana Teodoro Dyer. I'm a tarot based life consultant. And today I've got a message for the air signs. This is for Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra. So we're going to go in a little different order this week. You are feeling actually quite fired up. You're feeling very inspired. We've got Ace of Wands here. You're feeling at the height of creative of your creative powers and that you'd like to start something new. You'd really like to go forward in a new direction and you're so excited about this. You really, really want to push forward. Um, when you go in with that energy into your environment, however, you come up against some people that are kind of digging their heels in, that really don't want this change, that want things to stay as they were. And um, that for some of us can have us feeling a bit frustrated because we've got, we know that this is really, really what we want. This is our truth. And this is our, um, the warmth of our heart. We're just so excited about it. And we're like, why, why is there this opposition here? Um, so what these cards, uh, the next three cards are your advice. So we have the Knight of Pentacles, and I'm sorry, the camera switches it. He's riding towards the Ten of Pentacles, and then on the other side we have the Emperor. So what they're trying to remind you to do is to move slowly. This is a very slow moving card. Um, like an earth sign, it's very certain that he will get to his destination, but it just takes forever. <laughs> but keep in mind that slow progress is going to be, is gonna pay off more than fast progress this week, because what we're trying to do is we're trying to build something very stable and very, very um, prosperous. Something that's really gonna last and something that represents a form of fulfillment to you. But this presence of the emperor is saying this is fulfillment on your own terms. So in the past, there may have been some where you accomplish things, but you don't get to say a lot of the process. You don't have a say in a lot of the process. Or maybe you accomplish something that's not even really what you want. But what they're saying is you are on the path to making something that's on your terms, that's built exactly the way you want to see it. Don't worry about this opposition you're getting from other people. That's just natural because people tend to not like change and people don't like to give up what's familiar. Um, but don't push too hard with your fiery energy here, with this energy of being so excited and passionate. Don't push too hard. Trust the slower progress because the slower progress is absolutely going to make something much more stable and much more lasting for you. So that was a quick and easy one. Um, want to warn you a little bit, we've got Mercury retrograde coming up. This affects our communication and also our, also our electronics. And since we're so dependent on electronics in um, for our culture right now, I think it really hits us hard. So you being an air sign, really watch your communication this week and don't get frustrated if people don't understand you right away. Um, it's just part of the planetary pull on us. So anyway, hope this was helpful. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and um, you can get these weekly free updates. If you'd like a private one-on-one -on -one reading, I am definitely available and more than happy to do those. Um, I love doing one-on-one -on -one readings. Um, just something really, really magical happens when the information comes through for the person and um, we get to really, really work, work on you, see what's going on with you. So um, hope you have a great week. Um, you can check out my website below if that's interesting to you, the one-on-one -on -one reading here. My communication's going weird. Uh, <laughs> I hope you have a great week and um, best of luck with this project. It looks like it's really, really gonna work out. Talk to you soon.